Hello everyone, it's me, Mr. 4K. Uh, this video has been uh, long overdue. It's a Asus Origi Li running Starfield. Can you run Starfield on Asus Origi Li? Well, we're going to find out in about a few seconds. So let's dive right into it, shall we? Let's load it up. Um, I just want to advise you guys, you need to download the drivers from uh, ROG uh, Asus website. You can go to AMD and get the drivers because the AMD doesn't support drivers uh, for the uh, Asus ROG Li. Uh, ROG Li is the one that's working on the drivers. So you have to go to the uh, Asus ROG website to get the drivers, meaning you cannot go to a traditional uh, AMD website and get the drivers. It doesn't work like that. I was kind of surprised that that's how they're doing it, but that's because they're looking at this um, the, uh, AMD. It's giving um, a Asus their own uh, way of uh, updating the drivers and all that. So AMD takes care of the uh, GPU hardware for their GPUs that you install on your PC, right? So long story short, um, you cannot just go to a uh, AMD website and then look for the drivers for Asus uh, ROG Li. You're not going to find them. They're not supported. I don't know why. There's some kind of a deal that AMD and, and Asus have made where Asus wants to be the one responsible for updating the drivers because uh, it's a custom design chip for Asus ROG Li, so AMD gave them that flexibility. <clears throat> I still have COVID, but uh, I'm a little bit better. Uh, all right, so let me show you my settings, basically what my settings are. Let's turn down this music a little bit. I like this music, but it gets annoying after a while. Um, so as you can imagine, my uh, resolution here, it's uh, obviously native 1920 by 1080. I didn't scale it all the way, I scaled it to 84% just so you can look a little bit more cleaner you have to uh, set everything to low i set all my settings to low uh and i'm using the upscaling dynamic resolution with 84 percent right here 84 percent so let's see uh let's start it up the reason i mentioned the drivers because a lot of you are going to make the same mistakes like i did looking for the drivers on AMD website and you're not gonna find it don't bother so I'm just giving you a heads up and you guys are welcome go to the uh, ROG Asus website and that's where you're gonna find the drivers for Asus ROG Li anything related Asus ROG Li any drivers for the for the sound graphics etc etc you need to go to their website that's where you're gonna find all of the available uh, drivers. So I'm just giving you a heads up so you guys know. So you don't end up wasting time looking at the wrong place. Oh man, this is smooth. Smooth as the butter. This looks pretty good, man, with uh, 84% uh, Let me see This looks pretty good at 84% scaling uh, resolution 
not bad at all. It's, uh, looking at the first person view. Very impressive. Not bad, man. Not bad at all. I think I'm supposed to buy something here. Yes, is he getting, is the fan kicking in? Oh yeah, the fans are kicking in big time. And you can definitely, uh, you can feel it blowing that hot air out. I have to say this looks pretty darn good. Uh, So what I would recommend that you guys do is, uh, all right, make sure you keep everything on the low settings. Turn on your dynamic resolution and make sure that your scaling resolution is at 84%. So 84%, 84% is where you want to be. This is my Joe Miller character that I created. Yes. Very good. This is pretty impressive. I love this that I can play uh, Starfield Man in the palms of my hands. You know, this is why I got this device. Like when, when you're traveling somewhere, or let's say you're in the hospital, right? Uh, I almost ended up it's in a hospital because I was so sick. Uh, and this would definitely come in handy. You know what I mean? I don't know if they would let me play it, but, you know, I would try to work my way around it. Because, you know, they would probably shove all kinds of needles in you. Um... So I need to buy a, a specific kind of a drink. New customer. Bienvenue. Before you order, I have two simple rules you need to know. Oh, this is my place. That means everyone in here is under my protection. You don't mess with them, they don't mess with you. Okay, I get it. If you're buying drinks, you better have cash. Madame Sauvage does not offer credit. Good. You Ça know... This is how we're being treated, right? After we uh, liberated France during World War II. <coughs> this is how the France is treating us. I'm just kidding. It was a joke. Uh, I love your accent. Where is it from? Oh, well, thank you very much for the compliment. I'm told my family tree traces itself back to Europe, on Earth, specifically the region known as France. A long and proud history, no? Yes, uh, like Napoleon, yeah. How many people did he kill? Yeah. Crazy general. <clears throat> Finally, someone who listens and does what they're told. A rare commodity in Epside. I like you already. Mm. Your rules are duly noted. Thank you for explaining them at the outset. So, what can Madame Sauvage get you? Have you come to try Velocity, perhaps? Or do you prefer something with a little less kick? Give me a Velocity. Velocity. It's nothing less than heaven in a glass. As though the universe itself was resting her lips on yours. My own personal creation. Let me see the menu. Of course, of course. Anything for my special new customer.
squares the velocity. Velocity blue. Potent alcoholic beverage infused with uh, They got so many velocities. Wait a minute. All right, so what do I think so far? Well, this is impressive. Um, I really didn't expect uh, Aces Hour GLI to be able to handle this game, but dude, uh, pretty, pretty impressive though. Well, this really gives you uh, a certain value. So when you purchase uh, Aces Hour GLI this holiday season, remember, it's a PC in the palms of your hands. Uh, and you can play everything and anything on your, that you can play on your PC, you can play on this, on this thing. Especially if you install a 2 terabyte SSD, uh, NVMe. It's really not that difficult to install uh, NVMe SSD. If I can do it, you can do it. Uh, however, you are gonna need a, a flash memory to back up your uh, original Windows copy, Windows 11 copy. And then when you install uh, your NVMe, then you can use that. Uh, Meaning your SD memory card. On your SD memory card, that's where you store your Windows. And then when you install your NVMe SSD, then you put in your uh, SD memory card. And from there, you can boot up your window. Like I said, if I can do it, you guys can do it as well. It's really not that hard. Uh... 2 terabyte SSD, it's more than enough for you to put a bunch of games in this thing and play. Trust me, you're gonna love this device even more. So, yeah, this looks great. I mean, um, I know this video is long, but uh, I really want you guys to see how well it runs. I want to go through all the details. Uh, like I said, the first thing you need to do is you need to uh, go to the uh, ROG ASUS website to get the drivers. Any drivers regarding GPU uh, or uh, audio drivers or CPU drivers, uh, it has to be done through uh, ASUS ROG website. So that means you don't go to AMD looking for the graphics drivers on this thing. You go to the ASUS ROG website called ASUS ROG LI. Now let's also, uh, let's put the scaling all the way to, uh, to maximum. I want to see what happens if I scale everything to, to the hundred. Oh, nice. So you can easily scale to the 100. Just make sure that uh, all the settings are set to low. But you can easily... Uh, yeah. Yeah, your rendering resolution scale, 100. Everything else is low. 
and that's where you want to be so these are the settings that i recommend now for you guys your rendering resolution scale 100 and everything else low motion blur off and the v-sync you can turn that on and of course uh your upscaling fsr too you can leave it on and your dynamic resolution you can keep it on but make sure you scale it 100 percent the reason you want to scale it 100 percent is so you can get a really good sharp image so it looks good when you're playing it and it will look good trust me Yeah, it's pretty uh pretty impressive though. So let's see what we're we'll getting here. We are getting somewhere around 28 frames per second. Close to 30. 30. Listen, man, this is pretty darn good. Uh, for a handheld device like this to be getting... Uh, but you know what? Let me... Uh, let me move the... Uh, rendering rendering scale to uh, 84 I think you guys should leave it at 84 keep it at 84 like we uh, like we did earlier 84 you see now we got 30 plus frames so rendering scale at 84 It's about the same. Nah. Don't bother. You can, you can keep the... Uh, rendering uh, resolution. Uh, render resolution to 100. It's fine. What about sharpening? I don't know. I mean, you could try a little bit of sharpening maybe at the 23. get 30 frames not bad listen this game is poorly optimized even on, on, on a PC man even on like a high-end PC man this thing it's poorly optimized but the fact that you can play this on a Asus ROG handheld device it's pretty amazing dude uh, you know it's pretty impressive This only uh, makes it uh, more desirable uh, device. I know there's a Lenovo coming out with their own. Uh, I'm definitely going to be looking forward to that. Look, all I want to say is this. It's pretty impressive that it handles this 
game at 30 FPS, dude. That is pretty impressive. Now, is there blowing a lot of heat from the fan? Yeah, of course. Now we're getting 35 FPS here. Here, let's see. Uh Let's do our warp drive jump. Here I'm getting 34 frames now. It's pretty good. So uh, you can easily go ahead and uh, get that rendering uh, scale to the maximum. And the reason I want you to get the rendering scale to the maximum, it's so you can enjoy a better clarity and sharper image. Sharpening, uh, it's up to you. I left it at 23%. That's uh, that's optional if you want to, but I left it at 23%. You don't appear to have an appointment, but we welcome walk-ins. Doc, and let's see how Trident Luxury Lines can help you. I think you all should be very happy uh, about the way uh, Starfield runs on uh, Asus RGLI. And I hope that this video really helps you. That's why it's so long, because I want to go through all the details. You know. For those of you who might be thinking about maybe getting an uh, Asus uh, ROG Li, well, hopefully this video will help you out. You know. Give you some idea. And I know some of you are going to say, well, maybe this video didn't need to be this long. Uh, fine, but this is my channel and this is the way I make videos. You know, this is the way I roll. This looks pretty darn good with. Uh, rendering scale to 100 and sharpening to 23 uh, percent looks quite detailed keep in mind this looks much better in person there's something about playing it on a on a handheld device man i can't explain it's just there's something to it welcome to try it We gotta give this lady a drink. Just making sure everyone feels safe. So we can go in here and steal something. The galaxy must see. Rest assured that every inch of a I have a philosophy for you. Here you go. Was reviewed by my you greedy old bitch. And my trusty staff. I see. 
Hand it over, please. So this is the velocity I've heard so much about. I must say, I'm cautiously looking forward to partaking in it. I shall see if it lives up to its great expectations. Well, it seems you've done what I asked for you. I promised you reimbursement, so here it is. I'm sure having the privilege to run this errand for me was payment enough for you. But I am a woman of my word. Now, run along, please. I have much work to do. The future of space travel. Oh my god. Too much talking. You sound very full of yourself. Yes, yes. Goodbye. Alright, she's gonna be all she's all wasted now. Uh, I wanna save the game really quick. All right, guys. Well, I'm not. Of course, I'm not gonna do a gameplay here. Uh, I just saved the game so I can continue playing it. Uh, I know this is a long video again, but this is the way I run my channel. It is what it is. Hopefully, some of you will appreciate all of this detail, so that way you understand what to expect uh, from ASUS RGLI and Starfield. So let's just rehash this pretty quickly. <clears throat> the drivers for uh, ASUS RGLI, any drivers for ASUS RGLI, you don't go to AMD. You only go to AMD if you got a, a, a desktop GPU from AMD. Okay. It will not detect a AMD GPU here. That's custom design. You have to go to ROG ASUS LI website. Any drivers regarding the GPU, you have to go to the ASUS ROG LI. Any drivers regarding uh, their network frame, uh, sound card, you got to go to any drivers, period. You got to go to the uh, ROG ASUS LI website. That's where you get all of your. Uh, drivers and uh, once you do that as you can see good to go another thing when it comes to uh, settings keep your render resolution scale to 100 everything else to low turn off your motion blur you can turn on dynamic resolution, but make sure it's uh, scaled to 100. Sharpening, it's optional. You can leave it at 23%. And you're going to be getting somewhere between 30, 28, 35. Some instances, you might be getting 120 frames. The frames, they, they vary depending where you are. Depending where you are on the map. Uh, but considering this is Starfield, even on a, on a high-end PC, it's throttling. It's having difficult times. So considering that we're playing this on a Asus ROG Li handheld device, it's pretty darn impressive. So there you have it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. This is Mr. 4K signing out.